911. I need somebody out here, maybe even an ambulance. What's going on? Every tribe has their own story about their trail of tears to Oklahoma. Um, there was sorrow, death. We were relocated 200 years ago. Our son was shot and killed here in our kitchen. He was shot seven times, once in the back of the head. Our grandson was taken by those same weapons that were used at those two massacres. The two cops that killed Mahavis Goodblanket received medals of valor. More than 125 years after the massacre of 300 of my people, they are still giving medals for killing Indians. They go in the window with their guns like this. And Wilbur says, don't shoot our son. The Cheyennes are a nation of people that have survived two massacres and policy that was meant to exterminate them. They should be soundly whipped. They are the enemies of the United States of America. Unfortunately, this is what it takes to build a country. You were about as likely to be lynched if you were a Native American in Oklahoma by the Ku Klux Klan as you were if you were black in Oklahoma. You know, people say, oh, that happened so long ago. Y'all just need to get over it. Well, it's not that simple because it has impacted families and generations. It's, it's called historical trauma. This was the original building for when they were integrating Indian children and assimilating us into white society. To become a Christian means you leave behind everything that makes you an Indian person. Well, next morning, yeah. she re-enters the house and is extremely intoxicated. People don't understand it. It isn't a drug. This peyote is a sacrament. Shot fire, load off a shot fire. We want them to be held accountable for what they did. Same caliber. This is going on all over the country. This is not an isolated Peyote. incident. This is a major issue. Savage land, we in a savage land. Cops don't care, they will kill you dead. Savage land, we in a savage land. We want the truth.